Hi, I'm Greg. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to draw with a 3D printer. A 3D printer works in a very similar way to how a two-dimensional plotter works. So it has the x-axis and the y-axis. That means I can attach basically anything I want to the print head and draw a pattern with it. So let me show you how I did this and how you can too. So here is my homemade 3D printer. It uses a Bowden drive system, so there's actually less stuff on the print head. So the first step to getting your printer to draw things is actually removing the hot end and all the fans. You just remove these two screws that hold down the heat sink and everything pops off. All right, so now that you've removed the uh, extruder assembly over here, it's time to attach the pen to the carriage. All you need to do is just take a bit of tape and wrap it around the uh, pen. Okay, now let's attach this pen to the actual printer. What you have to do is attach the brace and then just take your pen and slide it in. Now you wanna make sure that it's approximately at the same level as the nozzle was, because if not, you will have issues. Now that the pen is attached, uh, let's jump into the software and configure the printing file. So this is the part where you actually turn an image file into a toolpath. So let's do this. So when you're looking for images online, you have to make sure that they have a reasonable amount of contrast between the different shapes for this to be successful. And so just open it up. It, it should be a JPEG because with PNGs I had lots of issues. So open that up, the height should be the same as your layer height, the base should be at zero, width and depth is whatever you want it to be, like physically in size. So, I'll do it. so you see now, there's like a mesh, and you can see the actual uh, shape. So now let's uh, slice this. Now, I'm going to put all the settings into the description down below because I don't want to talk about these for 10 minutes. And boom, see that? That looks pretty good, I'd say. Yeah, let's uh, let's put this into the printer. All right, so I've got the uh, I've got the file loaded in here on the SD card. It's ready to go. So the last thing you need to do before you can actually uh, draw with this thing is unplug the extruder motor. This is because you don't want it to do cold extrusions while you're printing, and you have to attach a piece of paper to the print bed. So I'm going to just do this by putting it on top of the glass and clipping it on. Now that you have the uh, paper attached to the build plate, it's time to make sure that the pen is level. It's finally time to start drawing. Let's do this. Just So these drawings came out pretty well. The lines were nice and pronounced and overall I'd say this was a success. Now this is slower than a traditional printer, but I find it really interesting to just watch it draw something. And you could probably get away with saying that you drew these things. At least the more simple ones with no infill. So my question for you is what would you draw with this type of machine? Let me know in the comments down below. Now, that's all for today. Make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed this video. It really does help out a lot with the YouTube algorithm. And if you want more content like this, make sure to subscribe. I'll be posting uh, these videos every weekend. So, you know, more videos are coming. So that's all for today. See you next week.